East Watertown is a community a portion of Watertown that's pretty special to me for a lot of reasons. When most people think of East Watertown, you know, you're going to look towards the Arsenal Project and the Watertown Mall, Target, Home Depot and stuff. Uh, but for me personally, it's where my family roots are. Uh, both sides of my family, my mother came from a Greek family, my father an Italian family. And they both grew up on Berkeley Street in East Watertown. And I was having a conversation with my grandfather the other day, who way back, his family actually rented from my mother's family. Uh, so there's a lot of family history there. And my grandfather was telling me, you know, rattling off all the names of the families that grew up on Berkeley Street. You know, he talked about his first job at Euphrates Bakery, uh, which was very popular, you know, decades ago. Uh, and also the Arsenal, which was built in 1816 and was, you know, pretty active up until about 1965 when it was, you know, given over to Watertown rezoning. Uh, but that whole area is booming right now. And the reason is because money has flowed into Cambridge and Boston, obviously, and it has nowhere else to go because the market has just taken off there over the past 10 years or so. So where does it go? East Watertown. And I think we're going to see a larger boom coming to East Watertown in the next decade or so because of Athena Health purchasing the Arsenal project and getting tech centers and labs and shopping and restaurants. The branch line is Watertown's newest restaurant. Um, Panera Bread, La Casa de Pedro's is over there. So high-end dining, improvement of public transportation, and development of the Arsenal Street corridor means East Watertown is going to be pretty much on the map. Um, so it's a very fascinating uh, location in Watertown. A lot of small family-owned markets. Um, there's a CVS being built on the corner of um, Arsenal, Mount Auburn Street and uh, Grove Street there. And uh, the area has just been seeing a lot of development over the last couple of years that should propel housing prices in the next decade or so. So it's very fascinating. Um, keep an eye on East Watertown because it's it's one of my favorite places in town because it's a lot of cultural, it's very cultural. Uh, I grew up going to the Greek church on Bigelow Ave. I have a lot of friends who grew up on the Armenian church, going to the Armenian church on Bigelow Ave or St. James on Mount Auburn Street. Um, so it's it's great. It's it's a wonderful community. Make sure you hit up all the little shops and stores there because it's kind of Watertown's hidden secret. Uh, but anyways, that's a little bit about East Watertown.